Hi, it's Janie. Welcome back to my channel. And today's video is going to be a few purchases I made during the month of September. Um, I have some stuff from Ulta, Sephora, and um, It Cosmetics, I do believe. Anyway, so let's start with what I purchased at um, Sephora. Um, I don't know when it was, a few weeks ago, they did a, um, a beauty event where if you were like VIV Rouge, you got four times the points, points, and if you were an insider, you got like two times the points, and then they were doing where uh, you were able to get some of the Christmas gifts or sets early, and then also they were doing like a little free bag that had a bunch of samples in it. Now, I will tell you that I did not get to go in store and shop. I did sign up for the event, but it never fails. It always something comes up to where I don't actually get to go. But I did do an order online and was able to get the, um, the gift bag that had the samples in it, which was this here. You just had to put in a code. It was called, um, I think it was called Your Gift. And I just put that in there, and with my $25 purchase, and got a bag full of a whole bunch of different samples plus the samples that I picked which they didn't send the samples that I picked so aggravating um, so I got like perfume samples that I didn't want I picked skincare but I got sad perfume samples yeah I didn't want perfume samples anyway and I did do two two orders I did two orders and um, one of the orders that I did I put in that code for um, this little thing for free and then the next one I put in a code where I got this um, Dior Rouge Dior lipstick in the color 999 which is a matte it's just a little baby one and I had to get this I had to I mean first of all just how cute that is with it being just a little baby oh my gosh so cute but more importantly is the color inside it. Look at that. It is a beautiful, beautiful red. Mm. But you know, I like red. It's right there. So pretty. So I got that. And what I ordered with this to get this code, I don't even have sitting right here. Cheapers. So hang on, once again, I gotta go over here and get my stuff. In order to get that, which I just didn't order these, these have been on my wish list for a while and they're always out of stock, but it's the Makeup Forever um, empty palettes that you can put your loose eyeshadows in. It's kind of like a Z palette, but a lot cheaper and in my opinion a lot better because it's tin and they are only, let's see, the size here was... $13, I think. Yeah, $13. So I had to think about it. So I got two of those. And they just they shut down, snap down. The only thing is, they don't have the clear front where you can't see in them. But I am going to put all of my um, my MAC eyeshadows in here. That's what those are. That are already in there. It also has this little sponge top to it. If you wanted to keep that in there, you could two of those and then got this lipstick and then some samples okay the other order that I did when I got this was just two things and one was this little uh, travel size of the glam glow glam glow mud dot com is that what that says glam glow mud dot com oh wait no glam glow flash mud Oh, lordy be. Anyway, just a little baby thing. I mean, this looks kind of pricey for being the size. I don't know. I was thinking it was going to be bigger than this for some reason. I mean, I knew it wasn't going to be as big as the actual full size, but I was thinking it was going to be bigger. But anyway, I ordered that. And then I also got this right here from Kat Von D. And this is the Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. This is the limited edition. Um... This is the one that she came out with that um, X amount of proceeds from the sales is going to the Save the Chimp Foundation. So I definitely wanted to get this to support that cause. And the color is called Project Chimps. 
and let's see what the color actually looks like. I think it's more like a like a brick red, which is going to be really, really pretty for fall anyway. I mean, it's a pretty color. And I think it's a color that a lot of people can wear. So that is it right there. It's really pretty. So I got that. And that was what, that was all I got. I didn't order any of the, um, the Christmas sets. Um, there's just not any that I've seen so far that have just really maybe want to say yeah i want to get that other than the tom ford which hasn't come out yet and of course won't be available at support anyway but um yeah i just um to me the two-faced ones look too much like what came out last year they look too much like um the colors the eyeshadows and things that are already in my chocolate bar palettes that I have, my peach palette. So um, Tarte, I have discovered that I like the looks of Tarte, but I get Tarte and then I never ever ever use it. So I have just decided I'm not even going to buy Tarte anymore. It just, just doesn't work for me. And um, I just decided this year I'm going to be very, very, very selective on what I purchase as far as you know, all the gift sets and stuff that's coming out anyway so let's move on to let's move on to Ulta I made a Ulta order and I like to do an Ulta order when they're doing like some really good um, free gifts with purchase or if they're doing a really good sale of some sort and this is what looking through everything that this is what kind of led me to get this order okay anyway um, what prompted the order to start with was they were running this little palette right here from bare minerals called the nudes and the nature of nudes they were running it half off so it was $21 instead of $42 and so I got this and this is the palette here and this is what it looks like on the inside right there and I will tell you this is a beautiful beautiful palette I I was like well do I really need that no um, do I use my bare minerals anymore hardly ever um, my loose pigments I don't hardly ever touch them anymore I have a bunch of the little the what is it the ready 4.0s and the ready 2.0 shadows that I have depotted I thought if I depotted all of them I would use them more but I haven't but anyway I bought this and for about two weeks straight this is all I used uh, matter of fact my Vegas haul video I had this on and my pinch me box video I had this on so if you want to see a look from this palette just refer back to those videos I'll put some cards up here but anyway so pretty glad I got that and then I also got a brush like I needed another brush no anyway I heard Kristen Game talk about this brush and it's called the Eco Tools Deluxe Fan Brush and I don't know I just because she talked about it I decided I wanted it I really didn't need it I can't get it open. I mean, obviously, I haven't needed it because it's sat here for three weeks and I haven't yet opened it. So, anyway, this is it here. Just a really nice fan brush, I guess. So, I'll be giving it a go. Um, I know Walmart sells these, but the Walmart around me was never in stock with it. There was always something else stocked on that peg instead of the right brush so anyway so also with that order I got a couple of hair products and it's the Neoxon ne ne Neoxon Neoxon Diamax what's this stuff right here let me see if we can get you to where you can see it without it being a glare can you tell what that is or are you going to focus camera 
Okay, what this is, it's an intensive therapy and it's supposed to help for thickening the hair, making the hair look thicker and fuller. It had really, really good reviews. I've not used this before. Um, it has a little pump and they had them on sale. And then it was buy two and you get one free. And my third one that I have is in my bathroom. And I ordered it because you know, I'm thinking, well, I really need you know, help when I wear my hair down with getting some volume here in the crown, which I guess I think all of us probably have that issue. Anyway, I did not think, I wasn't thinking, because what this does is it expands the hair to make it look fuller, which is good. But when you have curly hair and you have a tendency to have frizzy hair and then you put a product on there that's going to cause your hair to expand yeah it wasn't very good so anyway I have those I may be I may be selling those but anyway so anyway so that was what I actually paid for and then they were doing some free gifts and one of the free gifts was a bronzer from Too Faced, the Chocolate Soleil, which we've all seen this. It's just a little baby travel size. And it's just that little guy right there. So, mmm, smells so good. I'd be glad when it gets cool enough to drink some hot chocolate without feeling like you're seeing from the inside out. I like hot chocolate when it's nice and cold. Anyway, so that was free. And then this other little thing was free that I haven't opened yet. And this is from Redken. It's the Triple Take 32 Extreme High Hold Hairspray. And this is a four ounce. This is a pretty good size free little hairspray. So it has a different kind of nozzle on it. Dang. That's, that comes out like, I don't know, can you see that? Look how, <laughs> it's definitely not a fine mist. That is like, shooting out at you. Doesn't have too bad of a scent. Hairspray scent. Okay. Makes me think of I'm at the hair salon getting my hair done now. Yeah. Okay. And then the other thing that was free was this right here from Bare Minerals. And this is the Kiss Me It's My Birthday little trio that they actually sold in store. This was $26 that was actually being sold in store. And um this was free and let me see if I can get it back open it's hard to open I had a hard time opening it the first time and then I could get the lid back on all the way there we go okay so what is in here is a full size of the moxie marvelous moxie um, wool lip cream butter cream it's a really pretty color I'm not going to open it or swatch it because I'm going to be doing something different with that and then there was a full size mascara, which was the Lash Domination Volumizing Mascara. And a full size of the Lasting Line in Black Eyeliner, Long Wearing Eyeliner in Black. And then there was, what is this? Oh, it's a little button that says, Kiss Me, It's My Birthday. So I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna wear it on my birthday when my birthday rolls around. And they're just a little pamphlet. So yeah, that was, that was a free gift. I mean, not going to complain about a free gift at all. So, got that. So that's what I got from Ulta. Oh, other than the little samples, I just told them just to surprise me with samples. And they surprised me with um, a perfume, Viva La Juicy. And another perfume called uh, Mr. Burberry. Hmm. Mr. Burberry. I wonder what you smell like, Mr. Burberry. My husband doesn't really wear a lot of colognes. Every once in a while, he'll put one on, but then when he does, he like drenches himself in it. Makes my eyes itch and my nose water and season. And I hate to tell him, no, don't put so much on. I'm whispering because he's in the next room. Because I would like for him to wear it because it smells good. But whew, put so much on. Lordy. Okay, let's see. Mm, don't want to yeah, I'll spray it on me because I'm gonna be I'm gonna be doing some cleaning here in a little bit, so it'll come off anyway. Hmm. Not 
bad. Nothing too special. Just smells like a typical men's cologne. Kind of like the soapy smell. It's okay. It's not bad. It doesn't stink. I like I like ones that smell like with a little bit of tobacco. Which I don't know why because um, if I'm around anybody that's smoking, it irritates me. It makes me sneeze and my eyes start itching really, really bad. But for some reason, I like perfumes that smell like tobacco. Anyway. Okay. So, let's see. Where are we at on time? I've been talking, chitter-chattering quite a bit. Um, I want to go ahead and get do the rest because I've been holding off. But I did an order on the It Cosmetic website. And I did it on their website because I do get a pro discount. And I wanted to order because as we all know, they sold out. Um, L'Oreal now owns It Cosmetics. And I'm just hoping that they don't change their formula, change things around. You know how they do when they sell, sell out. So I'm just really hoping that things I really liked it cosmetics and I also really liked the fact you know that it was an independently owned company you know that this this lady that used to be a newscaster you know developed her own line of cosmetics that's good for you and and then she sold out do y'all feel that way do y'all feel like she just she sold out and I know she's supposed to be still you know a part of it and this that and the other but I'm sorry, but when companies start doing that, things change. And I know they say they won't, but they do. So anyway, so let me show you what I got. I did get another CC cream because I really, really do like the CC creams. I like to use these as a foundation. And I got two of them. I got fair and light because I want to mix the two. So I got those two. And then I got some... Um, lip liners quite a few lip liners because I really 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 do like her lip liners they are like a lip stain and I just feel like out of everything that I've tried as far as you know Mac um, Laura Mercier Bobby Brown um, NARS I just feel like these work the best for my lips for my skin for my lifestyle I like the fact that they you put them on and they do create a stain. They create a, a wonderful base for you to put your lipsticks on top and to help your lipsticks to last. Or you can wear them on their own as just a lip, lip stain. And I can't get this out of the box. There we go. Okay, so let me kind of tell you what colors I got. I got a Romantic Rose. And I'll swatch them at the end. Um, Perfect Red. I've had Perfect Red. This is like my third Perfect Red that I've gone through. Um, what color is this? I should have got this out of the box already. Then we have Spicy Nude. Okay. These are the ones that I ordered from the It Cosmetics. Like I was saying, these are the um, lip stain. They are called... Um, your lips bit better waterproof lip stain lip liner stain anyway so I got the colors cherry flush perfect red spicy nude romantic rose and blushing nude and this is this is the swatches of them, um, and this is the the first one that I talked about going all the way to the end. Uh, let's see if you can see those, hopefully. So if we can get that to focus on that. Can you see those? I hope you can see those really good. But if you've not tried these, definitely give them a try. Also, um, It Cosmetics is now at Sephora. They're at Ulta. They're also just now recently started being carried at Sephora. Um, I 
think basically what they have at Sephora right now is skincare, but the lip liners you can get at Ulta. So if you get a coupon where it works, or if you you know have points that maybe you can cash in, I would I would give these a try. Very good. Anyway, so that is it for the stuff that I purchased. I um, hope you enjoyed and um, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm just kind of looking and making sure I didn't miss anything. No, I did not. Okay, that's it. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and have a great week and I'll talk to you soon.